Welcome to Warner's Wheeling About. Just me messing around in my wheelchair and my cars. Morning folks, welcome to another video. Thank you for joining me. I had a bit of a surprise a couple of days ago in the post. I got a letter and it was a parking fine. Anyway, that's another story and I'll be bringing that to you soon in another video. But in the meantime, we're going to set out for for York. Um, now, if you've seen some of my other videos, you might have seen the one where I got a free charge at Lidl in Barton-upon-Humber and it was a 50 kilowatt charge. So by way of kind of offsetting the, the cost of this parking ticket, I've set my mind upon this month trying to pay as little as possible on charging. It's just my obstinate character. So um, if we if we go up towards um, the Humber Bridge, um, then we can stop at Barton, get a charge, and then that'll take us on to York, back across the Humber Bridge to Barton, get another charge that will bring us home. Bearing in mind, I've also now, because I'm a disabled driver with a blue badge, got a free concession to use the Humber Bridge. Don't have to pay that three pounds either. So I'm going to claw back this uh, 100 pounds one way or another. Okay, well, let's get going. Before we left home, I did check Google Maps and I wanted to see how many miles the Humber Bridge actually saves. For my journey from Lincolnshire, it was 11 miles, which when you divide that by uh, three pounds, it gives you 27 pence per mile. So if your car is more economical than that, then it doesn't make sense to use the bridge. It's 68 miles to our destination and we've got 71 miles of range it's 29 miles to Lidl. Well, we've left home about five miles, traveling down the country roads, about 60 miles an hour. And I'm astonished that the range has dropped from 71 miles to 51 miles. I mean, that's extraordinary. Made their own coffee got to save up for this parking ticket so another six or seven pounds on Costa coffee saved cheers right so here we are at Lidl in Barton upon Humber and let's see if that now turn sharp right. If that charger is still free. Please make a U-turn if possible. very difficult to see because of the angle um, the sun on the screen I can't actually see I know there's a start button around here somewhere ah, that was pure luck 
because I couldn't actually see the button. But anyway, I can hear the machine starting up. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into Lidl now. I'm going to use their bathroom facilities. I'm going to buy some food so that we can eat on the way to York and um, just get a quick quick charge and I'll check on my mini connect app while I'm in the supermarket. Just been to use the, uh, the toilet here in Lidl which is uh, probably one of the best uh, accessible toilets that I've used so full marks to Lidl for that um, now we're just going to buy a few bits well it's just 13 minutes since we plugged in the car and we're up to 75% already Well, I've just checked the app and we're on 89%. That was a 30 minute stop, which you concluded using the bathroom, buying a, just a few essentials. Um, and we're up to 95% already. So pretty impressed. So we're going to get on to York now, just see if I can... Turn right. Well, here we are in York, and I'm just looking for somewhere where we can park.
right here. Well, this is Pad Kapow, which is a Thai food my wife made for us before we left the house. Probably saved us about 30 pounds in restaurant bills. So, uh, just sitting down in the park by the Minster. Delicious. We had a lovely day in York. I didn't check the website and we just happened to pick the week that the uh, Minster is closed to the public because they have all of the uh, uni university student graduations. But we still had a lovely time. And uh, now we're heading back towards uh, Hull and the Humber Bridge. And then once we cross the bridge, we're gonna go back to Lidl and charge up again. We're back in Barton, the car's on charge, I'm in Lidl, I've used the disabled toilets, now I'm just going to get some shopping done. Another successful charge from the 50 kilowatt charger. Thank you Lidl and Pubpoint for that. Uh, we went from 31 miles to 106 miles range and we got home we still had 78 miles range and we averaged 4.1 miles per kilowatt hour. Pretty good. Thanks for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. It really helps me if you can give me a like and share and please subscribe and ring that bell icon so you're notified each time I post a new video. See you in the next one. Bye.